I'm Jonathan Harmon, and this is Tiger News for Monday, November 9th, 2020. Go Tigers! Happy Monday, Tigers. I'm hoping you had an awesome weekend. Please encourage your parents to check their email for the weekly parent update letter I sent out yesterday, Sunday. You can also find this letter on our webpage. There's a lot of important information there that will help your family make a decision as to whether you will remain on distance learning or return to in-person learning through a hybrid model starting tentatively on January 19th. To also help in the decision making, I will be offering a parent question and answer session today at 5 p.m. on Zoom. Your parents can access the Zoom meeting by using the Zoom user ID and passcode found in the weekly parent update letter. Remember, you only need to complete this online registration form if you will choose to stay on distance learning for the remainder of the school year. Reminder, we have no school on Wednesday in observance of Veterans Day. Indian Middle will host its first IMS Family Dine-Out Day Thursday, November 12th at Panda Express in Indio, near the Indio Fairgrounds. Come grab some delicious Panda Express anytime between 9.30 a.m. and 10 p.m. Some of the proceeds from the sales will go to our very own IMS ASB to support our outstanding student social events. Tigers have a beautiful four-day week, and as always, remember, Tigers Roar! Class, class. Good morning, Indio Middle School Tigers. My name is Miss Alicia. I'm from ACES, and I just want to send out an invitation to all of you for virtual tutoring. We are here Monday through Friday from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. If you would like to join tutoring, you need help with homework or anything else, you can use the link on the school website. I also wanted to invite you all for our enrichment hour every Wednesday. It's from 12.30 to 1.30. If you would like to join, please talk to one of your teachers and they will send an email to Mrs. Beltran or Miss Maelli or Miss Laura. Thank you, have a good day. And remember, tigers roar. Here's a look at our club meetings and activities for this week. For a given path, we'll be meeting today after school from 2.55 to 3.55 p.m. If your club normally has meetings on Wednesdays, please check with your advisor to see if it's been rescheduled. If you are interested in joining any of our clubs and activities here at IMS, please email the advisor. Class, class. Now let's head into the art gallery to look at some of our students' amazing pieces. I'm Jonathan Hartman, and this is In the Jungle with Miss Hartman. Mrs. Hartman, do you think you can survive the jungle? Absolutely. Okay, here we go. Round one. Julius Caesar was the emperor of what empire? Roman. What is the plural form of moose? The what? Moose. Moose. The Battle of Gettysburg was fought in what war? History. Skip. Who is the author of the novel James and the Giant Peach? Roald Dahl. What are the three branches of the U.S. government? Uh, judicial, executive, legislative. I'm Jonathan Harmon. We were in the jungle with Mrs. Harmon. Mrs. Hartman got four correct, which puts her in second place. Mrs. Balin is still in the lead. Next week, it's Mrs. Skogan's turn to enter the jungle. (laughs) 
Mr. Tobaldo would like to shout out Mrs. Harris's ELA skills group number two. They had a fantastic week. Great job. Mrs. Need would like to shout out her Friday second period class for showing their raw values and being the class with the most work turned in. Well done. Mrs. Mazze would like to shout out her homeroom students for having their cameras on and acting like a family in the chat. Kindness does indeed rule. And she'd like to shout out Luciano, Ivan, Axel, and Danitza for taking ownership and coming to Wednesday tutoring. Mrs. Harris would like to shout out her sixth period class for showing up every day and doing their best. You guys rock. And she'd like to shout out her homeroom class for putting a smile on her face every morning and making her laugh. As we leave you, we'd like to remind you to pause, take a breath, and remember. The greatest communication is usually how we are rather than what we say. That's all the target news we have for you today. Remember to be responsible, take ownership, act safely, and be respectful. For Tiger News, I'm Jonathan Herman. Have a mindful Monday, and remember, Tigers roar.